Imagine that you have a business idea. It is perfectly normal that you don't know if it is a good one. Bad news, asking around among your friends and family is not a reliable source. See what you can do to make your business plan as helpful as possible. By business plan, we don't mean a specific document that you deliver to the bank. It might be a draft piece of paper or an Excel spreadsheet, but it has to include a plan for the next activities. It seems simple, you write down what you will make profit on and how much will you spend. But how will you know that? Let's start with the easiest source of information. Write down the name of the service and the location. For example Yoga School Berlin. If you cannot characterize your idea in two four words you might be in trouble. This means that you want to create a business that doesn't exist yet. And this requires more energy, you will need to make people realize that there is something new and they should pay for the product, they probably don't need. But let's say that your industry already exists. See how Google can help us. From the list below you can see how many similar businesses are there in your neighborhood. Analyze some of them. See advertisements for premises for rent. Ask the questions from below. You will be able to estimate your monthly renting costs. Now it is time to see what other companies offer to their clients. First of all, look for similarities. This means that there is the greatest need for these specific items or services and they generate the biggest profit. See how much the companies charge. How big is the difference between the cheapest and the most expensive firm? If all the prices are low, you will probably have to decrease your prices too. If some of them are higher, this will mean that you can offer something better quality for a bigger price. Look for sales, extra offers and ideas. See what suppliers will you need and how far and how expensive they are. Now there is a time to look for opinions about your competitors. Are your clients happy? What do they complain about? Is it possible to fix it? Look at websites with opinions, Facebook groups and fan pages. Check how the field is developing in general. Using Google you can find reports and studies of specific fields and industries. It will allow you to find information about sales dynamics, biggest companies, and tendencies. Then read official data. Each country has a government organization that collects data and makes it into reports. Look into it, this is the most technically reliable source of information. In the meantime read professional portals and newspapers. You probably don't even imagine how many of them are there. Use social media to ask for details. It can give you the most recent tendencies and honest opinions. Pretend to be a client and ask a lot of specific questions from the customer's perspective. What bike store do you recommend? What do you think about this company? Or how are the prices and quality in this industry? It is more reliable source of information than asking your friends whether you should start a business. The last part is very important, smart people can learn from the mistakes of other people. Try to attend a fair or a conference if you have a chance. Meet with people and ask them for advice. If you don't want to ask your competitors directly find someone who have just retired or someone from slightly different field. To be even more experienced think about working for your competition for a while. It is the best way to see how the business works without risking anything. Think about any kind of apprentice or a regular job if you are not sure if you are good for this field. These methods might be complicated but it is the only way. Only about one third of companies survive the first two years of its existence. Make sure you are among them.